they've helped us. Um, we couldn't have done it without them, and they're all so friendly and so excited. And not only that, people are attending, the kids have been coming. The Philippines is one of the most exciting places to do evangelism because of the reception by the people. I've been to many countries around the world, and Philippines is unique in the way that people get excited and get involved, and I think that's a really memorable thing about being here in Tapolog in the Philippines. Yeah, so on this trip, I had a lot of great experiences. And one thing that I'm going to remember and carry to everyone and share with them is that we need to trust God more. God has given us so many gifts. He's been so good. We need to not lean on our own understanding and trust in God that He will provide. God has done so many good things on this gift. We had a lot of things that would come up, issues, concerns, and worries, but it all works out. God always provides. And that's one thing that we have to always remember. And I'll remember also on this trip to share with people, God always came through, always provide. We always need to remember what God does for us and He always carries us through. So that's what I would want to share to everyone when I get back home. Thank you so much. May God bless you. I've been attending lots of crusades since childhood until now, but uh, the best and the unforgettable crusade that I have is now. Because during our medical mission last Sunday, when Arthur, a friend of mine from 53rd Batch Missionary, tapped me to be a translator for Mom Christy for a while, there's a woman there who is willing to let Mom Christy pray for her because she has gone through many problems, especially stress from her family. So, uh, upon doing the translation, I really felt how hard her life was. And when Mom Christy offered her a prayer, I felt the joy, the real happiness because I know that there is a precious soul longing for Christ to be in her life. So that's why that is uh, the most unforgettable experience that I have in this crusade. I hope that lots of soul will be longing for Christ to be under His feet. about search so we will continue to search the precious promises of God in the Bible in order for us not to forget about this crusade the second one is saving grace the topic for the whole week it is all about the saving grace of Jesus Christ pinaagi ni mga crusade ato nakita o ato nadunggan ang may tungod sa grasya sa ginoo we will not forget the word saving grace and the last, we need to share what we have learned from this crusade. We share to them the amazing love of Jesus Christ and we share to them the amazing grace that comes from God. These three words, search, saving grace, and share. Hi, I'm Pastor Dan. It's been a thrill and a blessing to be part of uh, the Polak, which is where we heard we were coming, and now Polanco and the suburbs here. We've loved being in your community and being at this site. And I came to the church yesterday, I got to see the school. Anyway, we hope that uh, you will welcome the new brethren that will be baptized. You will make them officially part of the church and bring them into your heart. Jesus loved the church, I hope you'll love the church. And a year from now, these same people will still be in the church and active and finding a part. We pray for your new mega church someday, someday the new school, a hospital. These are big dreams, we pray they will all come true. Hope it won't be long until I can come again to Napoleon in this place. God bless you all.